Yeah, what's up with it? Do it cause I love it and I stuck with it We ain't with the sub and in the cut with it Please none the talks, I heard enough of it Like, what you gon' do? Where you at? Who you with? You ain't really bout this, don't talk about it Really on the move, on the map, never slip Keep your hands to your lips, don't talk about it Real eyes, real lies, real lies All the time, stand on it If we said it, we don't walk around it Loose lips, ink ships, red cup, blue strips New phone, who this? No, we don't allow it Really on go, I don't know what's an off day. Now we on roll, keep us. Yo, what is good, J.I. Squad? And welcome back to yet again another episode of J.I. Productions. It's your boy, J.I., and I'm back at it again with another banger video for you guys today. As you guys can see, we got Vader behind me, my 2021 Camaro SS1LE. If you guys are new to the channel, that's it right there. It's the 10 speed, not the 6 speed manual. A lot of you guys hate on me for that, but hey, that 10 speed, everybody knows. The 10 speed is faster in straight line than the manual, and that's what I bought the car for. To go down the quarter mile, don't really care for the eighth mile, but to go down the quarter mile as fast as possible. So yeah, man, as you guys can see, 2021 Camaro SS1LE, like I said. Walking around to the back, we're gonna get to what today's video is about, and that is my new exhaust system. Really and truly, it's not new. I've had this set up before I went with the AWE route, but because I have a daughter now, you know what I'm saying, you got to make dad moves, you feel me? So the AWE was just way too loud for my little girl's ears, so I went ahead and threw the stock MPP muffler back on, and today, as you guys can tell by the title and the thumbnail, we're going to be talking about it. Do I have regrets? Am I missing the AWE? Am I going to keep the setup like this for long term? Or am I gonna switch it up again? Honestly, you guys, I cannot cap. I really have been enjoying <laughs> riding around with the MPP on, um, just solely because if you guys are not familiar with Camaros and whatnot, and this is your first time coming to my channel, the MPP is Chevy's stock axle back that is actually active. So you can literally put it in stealth mode, you can put it in tour mode, you can put it in sport mode, and you can put it in track mode. All five of those modes actually change the tone of the car completely. So just to give you guys a quick rundown on what the exhaust setup actually is, let's go ahead and pop the hood and we'll start there. Oh well, yeah man, right down there we have the speed engineering inch and 7 eighths long tube headers. This car is catless. Followed by a three inch connection pipe all the way to an X pipe and then going directly out the stock MPP. Now what I'm gonna do for you guys today is I'm gonna go ahead and cut it on. I'm gonna rev it. I'm gonna go through the different modes so you guys can see how loud and how quiet this thing gets. Honestly, stealth mode is ridiculous and I really think this is the best exhaust setup bang for your buck. If you go long tube headers and you go catless and you leave the MPP, you'll get this beautiful sound. So let me go ahead, fire it up, rev it up for you guys, and we'll go through the different modes and whatnot. So we're going engine sound. Currently I got it on auto mode selector. So right now we're in sport. I'm gonna go ahead and switch it over to stealth mode. Valves just closed. I'm gonna rev it up to 3k RPM for each uh, mode. So let's get it. Okay, so that's stealth. I'm gonna switch over to tour. quiet we'll go over to sport you can hear instantaneously the valves open up a lot more <laughs> get back you feel me then we go to track Stealth and it's back to quiet. 
Now I leave it on auto mode selector because nine times out of 10, I'm driving in sport. But if I ever see a cop throw it in tour real quick, the valve's closed as you guys just heard. And we ain't got no problems, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> So yeah, you guys, um, that's just going through the modes. Honestly, one of the biggest things that I didn't like about the AWE track axleback was solely the drone, man. Every time I would get on the phone with anyone, my wife, my mom, my dad, the homies, none of them would be able to hear me because the car droned so much. It was literally overwhelming for the mic that's inside of the car and they just couldn't hear me. Now, whenever I get on the phone, all I gotta do is drop it into tour mode or even put it in stealth mode and you can't hear anything from the exhaust. It's honestly kinda like a Prius. Even in sport mode or track mode, there's literally little to no drone at all, so it makes the driving experience that much better. I'm not gonna lie, I guess you guys could call me old. I did just turn 24 uh, last Saturday, so I don't know. People are saying that, you know, when it comes with AIDS, you kinda wanna go back to a little bit quiet, get a little bit of peace of mind and whatnot, but honestly, bro, the car sounds phenomenal. I love the MPP exhaust. If I do switch up and go to a different exhaust, it'll definitely have to be an active mode exhaust just so that I can have that stealth mode and have the car be quiet when I need it to. Now, as you guys know, the AWE had 4.5 inch quad tips, man, and I love them to death. I really tried to get those put on the MPP. Unfortunately, the inlet for the AWE tips was too big for the piping. It's about a two and a quarter inch pipe on the MPP's mufflers, and then it's a three inch pipe on the inlet for the AWE tips so they just definitely weren't gonna work unfortunately so I had to leave the stock tips but that's only for now only temporary I do have my eyes on a new set of exhaust tips that hopefully I'll be able to make work with this system I've seen people do it before they've modified their muffler to put the MPP um, to that next level of appearance because you know we got the carbon fiber we got the diffuser splats and we got those puny exhaust tips just it doesn't work you know what I'm saying but you guys let me know what you guys think in the comments of the exhaust I hope the mic picked up the revs good enough nice and crisp I hope you guys can really get a true example of how loud this car can get with some headers and the MPP if you guys found this video to be helpful please give it a big thumbs up like I said drop in the comment section down below do y'all miss the AWE or are y'all happy that I went back to the MPP? Let me know down in the comment section down below. If you're new, hit that subscribe button. Turn on post notifications. We're on the road to 5K. You dig what I'm saying? I can't wait till we hit it. Because then we're going to hit 10K and then 20K and 30K. And the JI squad is just going to keep on getting bigger and bigger and bigger. We just hit 10K on Instagram. If you're not already following me on Instagram, go tap in JI Productions underscore. We also hit 11K on TikTok. If you're not following me on TikTok, I'm not too active on there. But I do post some bangers here and there. And we just hit like 11.5 on there. So, Let's just keep running this joint up, man. Building this army that we got going right now, man. I appreciate you guys for the support. I appreciate you guys for the love. Just keep rocking with your boy. But other than that, just going to wrap it up for today's video. Like I said, if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Turn on post notifications for the kid. And I'm going to go ahead and wrap this one up here. Let's go ahead and roll that outro. And I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace.